everybody. Welcome to Dorchester, Massachusetts. We're looking at the Boston skyline right now. I'm currently just got on the very beginning or end, depending on how you look at it, of Mass Ave. So today I'm looking to drive the entire length of Mass Ave actually, which is around 16 miles long. You can see the Prudential there. Uh, in the distance. So yeah, the, basically I'm looking to go all the way to Lexington, which is where Mass Ave ends. And we'll go through Boston, Cambridge, uh, Arlington, and Lexington, I think. I may have missed a city in there, but th those are some of the major cities we'll go through. I'll most likely divide this into two videos because it will be over an hour long. Uh, look at that, there's Victoria's Diner up there on the corner. I spent a few late nights there back in the day. Used to go there, you know, after the after you'd go out to a few bars at night and then uh, that was a place you could get food at uh, one or two in the morning. Good times, good times. Okay, so Mass Ave is one way for a moment. Okay, so this should just cut around to uh, back to Mass Ave where it's two ways. Here's the Boston Medical Center we're about to go under, and that's basically uh, South Boston now. I just love the buildings along uh, Mass Ave here. plan was to make it to Lexington today, but I think it's, it's, it'll probably be close to dark at this point. So I'll definitely take us as far as Porter Square. I think that should be doable. We'll see the, we'll see the sunset as we go along here. We're crossing uh, Tremont Street at this intersection in a second.
never you never know which way the turn lanes are going to be going. I always seem to be in the wrong lane. We're passing over Huntington Street now. That's the Boston Symphony Orchestra to our left. And uh, Symphony Tea Stop. And of course, a reflecting pool in the uh, Christian Science uh, building is to our right. Berkeley School of Music coming up to the right. There's a Berkeley Performance Center. There's Boylston Street. I've ridden my bike up and down Boylston Street uh, more than once. You know, check out my channel for that. And we're going to be coming upon the Mass Ave Bridge soon. It's just ahead. That's a big uh, milestone for going down Mass Ave. Uh, looks like it's coming down to one lane here. And here we are, we're about to cross the Charles River into Cambridge. Looks like they're working on the uh, bridge here right now. There's a lot of MIT buildings you can see on the horizon here. Driving down into MIT territory here. See, the car is trying to sneak up on my left. This big building with the columns. I believe that's 77 Mass Ave, which is an MIT building. Next stop is going to be Central Square, our next pass through. this building to the right here. It's interesting architecture. Okay, so we're basically in Central Square now. I don't think I mentioned, but it is frigid out there today. It's about 15 degrees out. 
there's a central square fire station to the left. Oh, there's Middle East and Zuzu to the left too. That's a, that's a staple of Central Square for many years. I'm glad it's still there. Phoenix Landing. It's a fun place. Central Square Red Line Station. Oh, that's the Cambridge City Hall to the right that we just went by. Sorry about that, I picked up on that one a little late. towards Harvard Square now. Definitely in Harvard Square now. Oh, look at that. There's a turkey on the road. Oh, look at that. There's some turkeys, or I think, I think those are turkeys. I wonder why it was slowing down. Wow. Huh, that's, that's an odd sight to see just walking around Harvard Square. <laughs> Interesting. Square now down here and the Harvard Yard is just to our right. We'll cut down here and then we'll continue on to Porter Square. There's the Red Line station to the right. I think I need to get over to the left lane here to continue. Which I'll do now. This is the lane I want. Yeah, 
there's a sign for Porter Square. We will continue along. done this right I should be cutting out all these traffic stops and red lights nice restaurants and bars and well, just tons of stuff to do along here although I don't know what the status is with everything going on Square now. Uh, there's Leslie University in front of us, one of their buildings. There we go, that's the Porter Square T stop to the right. You can't miss that uh, sculpture spinning around. the shopping center to the right and then you have Christopher's and the Toad to the left. Looks like the Toad is still there. I used to love that place. The Newtown Grill. And then there's the Newtown Grill. Great pizza. 